Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. Here with John Terranova, trainer of Falling Sky. And John, you have a, a little bit of a speed ball in the derby, but um, how's he been training? And just tell us about your thoughts leading in the race. Uh, everything's gone really smooth here. He really seems to like Churchill. And, um, you know, we'll see where uh, where things unfold. He is, he is a fast horse, so, you know, we expect him to be forwardly placed. Can you just talk about how you arranged the partnership and what you liked about this horse when you picked him out? Well, Nick Salusta was the uh, orchestrator of the deal to... to put everybody together to go buy this horse. Um, he actually went to the OBS January mix sale and uh, he put everybody together. They're, they're uh, three guys that we uh, have several horses for a piece and um, we decided to put everybody together and try and get them. Now, how long has the horse been here at Churchill? Oh, he's been here. He probably got here first of April or so. Okay, and happy with the way he's handling the track and settled in? And... He's been great, yeah. He was here. He trained here before the Arkansas Derby. Breezed very well for it. Shipped to Oakland, ran, then came right back here. And uh, since then, he's, he's trained fantastic. Can you talk about his running style? Because in the race that he won, the Sam Davis, that was wire to wire. But he has come from a little bit off of it to win before. He has. He has. It's just, uh, you know, I don't think there's been a lack of speed in some of the other route races that he's been in. So uh, he's been able to, you know, either go to the front or be right there. But uh, he has been able to sit off uh, some horses in his early races. So, you know, he, he can do it if need be. You've been eyeing some competition out here. And who, who's impressed you getting over the track? Um... I mean, I think a worm is, yeah. is pretty much uh, the horse that looks looks like the the right one right now. The so beast. Yeah, he, he does. Looks he does. Like but there's a lot of ones that look good. Mm -hmm. You know, a few of uh, Todd Fletcher's, who's right next door to us, uh, they look really good. Overanalyze uh, uh, Revolutionary and Palace Malice, particularly. You know, mm -hmm. Verrazano's always been a monster of a horse, but uh, you know, they're all. They all deserve to be in there. They look great. Now, what is it about your horse, personality-wise, and also running talent-wise, that makes you think he will do well here? Well, you know, he, he has trained very well over this track. He gives us 100% every time he's been out there and tried real hard in the afternoons. But, um, yeah, he's just got that, he's just got that special something. He's, he's a good horse. All right. Well, good luck. Thank you. Isn't Nick also part of the